Hey YouTubers, how are you today? Mommy Ray Ray coming with another recipe, guys. How is everybody today? Today I am going to make you some curry chicken, guys, my way. So I have changed things, probably different from what you've been seeing, it, guys. But I hope you guys will just go on this journey with me. I have my chicken that I washed with a little vinegar and some lemon, guys. I have carrot, green pepper, garlic onions and a little ginger and my potatoes cut up and some olive oil any oil you want guys you can do it i have a little salt and i have pepper and i have my curry powder guys what i'm going to do i'm going to show you how you should do this and how i do it i'm going to put a little bit of this salt all over the chicken you see that guys i'm putting it all over and then i'm going to put some pepper on here because we're going to sear our chicken first. And I want to put it inside of here, guys, so that I can kind of move it around and massage it in. So I'm putting it in here now. And I wanted you guys to see it just so you can know. And I'm going in with a little more of the power, um, pepper, guys. Just a little bit more and a little bit of salt. So, guys, I'm getting ready to go and put this in the skillet. And let you guys see how we should sear this chicken here. I'll be right back. All right, guys. I'm going in with my oil that I'm going to sear my chicken with. Okay? That's what I'm doing now. I'm going to take my chicken and I'm going to sear it. This is my hot skillet, guys, on a medium-high heat. I'm having company today, guys, so... A little more chicken than probably what you would normally see me with. So we just want to sear this. All right. So what I want to do, guys, I want to let this like cook on each side for about three minutes. Turn it over, and I'll be right back. All right, guys. So my chicken is finished searing now. So I'm taking it out like I did. I let it um sear for about four minutes on each side, and I'm just taking them off, guys. And I'm going to show you this lovely curry chicken recipe, guys. Okay. So we took those off. And I'll be right back. All right, guys. I'm back. And this is what we need to do, guys. We need to get our curry powder. And we need to get our oil. I'm going to go in with the oil, guys. Alright, I went in with the oil, guys. Now I'm going in with just a little bit of, of the uh, curry powder, guys. You want to stir this up really good. All over your skillet. See how I'm doing that, guys? This is what you want to do. Okay? Because you're going to still need more curry powder. So hold on. And what you want to do now, guys, is you want to go in with your chicken and put it in your skillet. This is what we're gonna do. Okay. And I have my skillet on a medium heat. Oh, let's get it as strong, guys. Curry is very strong. You wanna lay it in there if you wanna put it in there just like that. Okay. Wow, it's strong. Curry is very strong. Alright, guys. And after you do that, guys, you want to go in with your water. Put all your love in there. See that? The curry is coming to a boil. It's coming up. So then what you want to do, guys, is you want to do next is you want to put your ingredients in. And that's when we're going to go in now with our onions, our green pepper, carrots, and garlic. We're emptying that plate out, guys. All that love is going into there. 
See that? See how beautiful that is? Just want to put that in just like that. It's a very easy recipe, guys. And I'm sure you guys will love it. I want you guys to try it. So we're just moving this around, guys. And I'm going to just let this steam up, you guys, for about five minutes, and I'll be right back. All right, guys, I'm back. I've let that all cook in. All my love has got together. I have a teaspoon of curry powder in here, guys, and I'm going to go in, wow, with mm -hmm. some ketchup, guys. All, all right, guys, I'm back. And I've mixed that curry with that ketchup, guys. That ketchup had kind of went everywhere, so I kind of stopped the video. So what I'm going to do now, guys, I'm going to pour this water in here. That's curry powder and ketchup. And you just want to just mix it together, guys. Because you don't want, it's going to suck it all up. The chicken is. It's going to, so this will be like my chicken broth, but it's ketchup and curry powder. And we're going to just pour it all in there, guys. Just make sure you don't lump it. Make sure it's melted down. Okay. We got that all in there. This is smelling awesome, guys. You should smell it. And last but not least, guys, I'm going to put the potatoes in. See how pretty that is? This is going to cook for about an hour. You want to keep checking it, guys. I'm going to get that down in there, those potatoes down in there. Okay. So once this all cooked down, guys, I'm going to come back and let you guys see what this looks like. It smells awesome. So I'll be right back. All right, guys. I want to show you this because I left this step out. You do want to cover this with some aluminum foil. You want to cover it up, guys. That's what you want to do. And just tighten it up really good. And let this cook. All right, I'll be right back. All right, guys, I'm going to go in and turn this off. I am back, and let's do this, guys. All right, this is our curry chicken, guys. See that, how awesome it is and juicy. Looks like a gravy. Chicken cooked very tender. Carrots, green peppers, guys. This is it. I'm going to plate this up, guys, and I'll be right back. All right, guys, I'm back, and this is what it is right here, guys. Curry chicken, Mommy Ray Ray's turnip and mustard greens and cornbread. If you like this dish, guys, give me a thumbs up a comment, and subscribe, guys. Have a great day, and you know how we do it. When we do it, we go in, guys, and we go hard. Voila!